Corona might have taken my trip, but she cannot touch my adventure. Hi, Trey. This one, this is Ruthie Otero, and I'm here with a quick story. Back in September 2019, I booked a flight to Italy from LA to Rome for less than $295. Oh my God, when am I gonna go? How about for my birthday? So I booked the flight for April 15th, 2020. Hmm. We all know what happened. And funnily enough, I was in a funk on April 14th without knowing really why. And I didn't think it was about Italy because I had given up on that when they had reached 15,000 cases of coronavirus. This is actually the second trip that I have missed out on for reasons that I could not control. The other trip was to Iran. I clearly have an issue with countries that start with the letter I. I thought I was fine about it. I realized I was just doing webinar after webinar and being on phone calls and doing a lot of busy work. Just found myself like not wanting to get out of bed. I was in bed watching webinars. I was like, stop. I'm supposed to go to Italy for two weeks. And then I had an idea. I can't go to Italy, but I can bring Italy to me. What about that? And I found myself feeling lighter. So that's what I'm going to do. But how am I going to do that? I didn't want to spend time in front of the computer reading about Italy. So here's how it's going to go. I landed Rome, so I'm going to visit ancient Rome, specifically the baths. I'm going to use olive oil to moisturize my face and my hair because that's what the Romans did. I'm going to cook things from Rome and I plan on going to Sicily. So maybe we'll make some cannolis and we'll visit other places with ingredients that I can find easily during this time or that we can modify. Of course, there's the food, but there's the music and the movies and the language and the people. So I hope to connect with all of that over the next couple of weeks and share it with you. So if you want to come on this adventure with me or create your own, it's possible. Anything is possible. I actually took a cooking class just outside of Rome online. I will be sharing that with you. I made butter sage ravioli. Me, it was delicious. So I hope you'll join me. I'll be posting about it. And if you have any ideas on what I can do, let me know in the comments below. And if there's some place you want to bring into your home, let me know. Remember, no matter what is going on, we can still make it a better story. Yes. Yes. Stay safe. Stay home. Stay grateful. I'll see you soon. I think that's it. Why? Who cares why? This is what happened and we're going to make the best of it.